launched in Ghana. It is hoped it will strengthen relations between the eight partner countries in the Square Kilometer Array project that stopped the biggest scientific instrument on Earth. A historic day in Ghana. The much anticipated radio telescope finally launched. It was converted from a telecommunications dish. It is my hope that the integration of this radio telescope into the African Very Long Baseline Interferometer Network in preparation for the second phase, construction of the Square Kilometer Array across the African continent will be successful. Roughly halfway between South Africa and Europe, Ghana is strategically positioned. I thank our partners in South Africa for their assistance, assistance in the satellite conversion process, and more especially for their help in the ongoing training of scientists made up of com computer scientists and astronomers in South African universities to manage and operate this facility. A joint project pioneered by South African and Ghanaian scientists is a giant leap for the continent. The African story beginning here will continue. Sites have been selected in Botswana, in Kenya, in Namibia. We are gathering momentum in Madagascar and Mauritius. And we have new plans underway in Mozambique and Zambia. Truly a Pan-African effort. The 32-meter radio telescope will form part of network of observatories. Mahakita Matabe, SABC News, Kutunse, Ghana.